range, the way I think, all around. Could it be a little similar to the fight we just saw Taylor and T.O.? Uh, you know, Spence being Taylor, natural, bigger guy, better jab, but T.O. more creative. Uh, taking advantage of of his in between shots. No, I think I think I can't I can't really compare Earl to Josh Taylor. I think it's two different styles, you know. So I wouldn't use that as. Uh, but is there a parallel in that the more creative fighter won, and, and that'll be the case in this fight? Or? Yeah, I, I feel as if Earl will make more adjustments along the way, and he wouldn't just fight the same fight every uh, the whole. Fight. I expect him to be, you know, making adjustments along the way, and he's a great professional. I remember, you, I remember you said because he was saying you're light in the ass, and then you told him no, you're fat. You know, a couple years ago, um, does he look a little heavy? Six, seven weeks out, did he look heavy a couple weeks ago? It, it, look, look. All that matters is he weigh in at 147 come Friday, and that's all that matters. He's going to be the same weight come weigh in. So what he weigh now, what he weigh then, it really doesn't matter. Hey, yeah, bud. Since we, Marcus will fight up, what's your mentality uh, for going into this fight? You've waited so long. So much has been said. Uh, now you're heading into the kill zone. What's your mentality? I'm just excited. I'm excited. I'm ready to get back to camp, get back to work. We've been having a great start to camp. Come July 29th, everything will show. We saw the big send-off with you in Omaha. Emotionally, what did that do for you? Well, emotionally, that just showed me what I already knew, that my city and my people, they behind me and they support me. That's all that showed me. And I want to give them a little gift of being able to send me off and wish me well. What were you saying to him up there, Terrence? What were you saying to Errol when you oh, first? Oh, no, we just letting each other know that it's, it's, it's time. We're here now. There's no more talk, there's no more wrong side of the street, there's no nothing. You know, we both here, we both acknowledging that, you know, this is that moment. This now, is, how do you feel at this point in time?